Hello, my little cauliflowers. In this new format, I will share live actions and comment on them to give you some hindsight on what's happening and what my decision-making process is. In today's battle, I'm facing an F-16. I will show you how I defended this fox and decided whether to recommit or not. I hope it will give you some hints on using the Mirage in an air-to-air -air engagement. Enjoy, and I'll see you guys pretty, pretty soon. Alright, let's uh, go into the action. So I'm following a what's called and TAF. And as usual, TAF is acting up and constantly switching between contacts. I keep constant eyes on three things. RWR is the most important. Then I try to pick up the target with my eyes. And TAF. And I keep spamming the airbox. Here is on the TAF. And within 10 nautical miles, I have no RWR nailed, so I make a run for it. Get a missile launch warning, followed by RWR warning. My reaction time isn't optimal, so I'll uh, defend and squeeze my butt cheeks. Also, at times, the contrails that will help me go offensive. To maximize survivability, I need speed, so I'll pull as many Gs as possible without dropping speed below the Mac. Slowly test the missile spike on my 6 o'clock position. Since I'm not dead, I assume the missile has been trashed already. Check for 16 nails, spikes. Recommitting. He's at 21,000. Lock the guy. 12 seconds to impact. Fox 1. He's almost in the beam, so he won't have time to turn hot. 120, he's turning hot into the missile. Attack commander, not in JTAC. He probably misjudged how close I was and he's gone straight to his face. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, keep it posted if you like that kind of content. I'll see you very, very soon.